At IOS 2025, postal presenters from around the world showcase groundbreaking robotic research. From intelligent systems and AI to real-world application, get a glimpse of the idea shaping the next generation of robotic innovations. Hi, I'm Nathan. I am from the University of Bath, that's in the UK. So my research is a hand exoskeleton that helps you learn how to play piano. So the idea is the fact that the user will put their hand into this and this device will only assist you when you're needed. So when you're playing well, it won't do anything and if you're playing wrong, it will correct you. The unique part is assist, assist as needed control will basically assist you only when you need it. So it, it's instead of like training and then seeing whether you got it, it will respond to your intentions. So a bit of embodied intelligence for this as well. There are a lot of sensors on it. So for example, if you were saying pressing the wrong key or whatever, they have FSR sensors. So there's an internal encoder to know which like uh, key you're on. And say if you're on the right key and you press the wrong with the wrong finger, the FSR will pick it up and will stop that finger from pressing. If you're on the right key and with the right finger pressing, the FSR will read that, know you, know you want to press that finger and then allow you to press. And on top of that, if you were say frozen in a location and you just weren't pressing anything, there's also a timeout fu uh, function where once it times out, it will then activate the system and it will press the key for you. My name is Gino Einer. I'm from the Chinese University of Hong Kong. I work on cable-driven parallel ro robots with the reconfigurable thrusters. So the idea is to have a, a cable-driven robot, but cable-driven robot, let's say that just cables have some problems, like for example, cables can just pull, they can't push. And also because of this, we need usually a lot of cables to effectively control the platform. So to remove cables, we add thrusters on top of it having a hybrid system. Thrusters can help cables and to improve the actuation capacity of the system, we have reconfigurable thrusters. This means that the thrusters are not fixed aboard the platform, but there is usually a kinematic joint and the kinematic joints have motors that can be controlled and to improve the full and exploit the full capacity of the system. Uh, my name is Yoshi Kimoto and I'm from Japan and I belong to the so Osaka Metropolitan University and um, my study is uh, about uh, so a snake root robot. The snake root robot has um, many joints and strength of body and can move in the wide range of environment in land or inside the hydro pipe and in water. And in my research, so I try to change the pattern of undulatory motion and with change of the kinematic viscosity in fluids are uh, using a uh, reinforced element rallying. And Snake Air Robot has few sensors. So now I, I achieved the, so the change of motion pattern only with previous information. Previous information is, so is the information which the robot cannot know. So it is a so difficult aspect. So when the motion pattern changed, okay, I did it. It's my surprising finding. 